gentlemen, my name is Justin Mark, international dating coach, relationship expert, VIP lifestyle development coach, and day game coach. Now, I know it's an awful. <laughs> what are we going to talk about today? We're going to talk about how to throw epic parties like a fucking goddamn legend. And I'm actually telling you a little bit of party I'm doing this weekend. So I had a student of mine who flew in to Toronto, Canada, and he wants to learn how to pick up girls, get dates, build confidence, build charisma. And so one of the ways I'm doing that is showing him how to throw parties. And the reason we're doing that is because learning how to bring people together is such a powerful skill. Simply put, your network becomes your net worth. Your network becomes your friend group. And by bringing people together, you become the social connector. You become the alpha male of whatever dynamic you're orchestrating. And you can also use that to meet tons of beautiful women. So I called up a few of my friends and we decided to throw a party this weekend, okay? And uh, we decided that we're gonna throw a bougie party. And within four hours, what we had done is we found a bartender, we found security. We found a caterer for the event who's gonna cater the event for free. We found a marijuana company that's going to sponsor the event and hand out $1,000 of free product. We found a drinks company that's handing out $1,000 plus of free soda water that we can mix with alcohol. We just brought this together like that. We found a photographer who's bringing a red carpet for the events. We found two videographers who understand what we're doing here. We're bringing all these things together and everyone gets a little bit of cloud off of it. Everyone gets to network. And the entire event, including all the guys involved with putting this together, and I guess you could call it stuff for this one party in my fucking house, right? Including the security, including the bartender, including the caterer, the chef, the uh, photographers, it's only 20 guys. And it's roughly 150 women who are all what we would call nines and tens, the hottest girls you'd want to meet, the prettiest girls you'd want to fucking meet, the girls who you DM them on Instagram and they don't fucking reply. So what we do is we get club promoters to bring the prettiest girls and only hot girls. We have rules, no uglies, no girls who are kind of, you know, not the cutest and uh, women with a very attractive demeanor, a vibe. And we let the girls know that this is exclusive invite only, don't bring any friends. Anyone who shows up has to give us their Instagram so we know who's coming, be added to a guest list, and we also let them know that they need to be in their best behavior and not embarrass us. All the guys showing up are, tend to be affluent individuals, right? And so we also have the sponsors of the event actually showing up as well. So think about this. The event is pretty much hosted by me, a couple of my friends, right? Who are all great dudes, right? And all of us are really good with girls. All of us meet a lot of beautiful women. And so together, literally in a few hours, we put together a guest list of 150 hot girls and the sponsor of the events are all millionaires. So it's a party of millionaires, TikTok influencers, YouTubers, business owners, seven, eight figure business owners. Seriously, isn't that fucking nuts? And then fantastic. All the other guys who show up, we pretty much say, hey, if you wanna show up, you gotta pitch in and add value. So we're telling any guy who shows up, they have to bring alcohol, donate it to the bar. They have to pitch in money to be part of the event. So guess what? The entire event pays for itself, okay? So this is pretty much a nonprofit party. But the best part is we get thousands of dollars of value, catering, free marijuana, free alcohol, photos, videos, red carpets, uh, DJ, you know, the best of the best of the hottest girls, like the best, like think about like the girls who are hooking up with celebrities, there are girls who are like literally girls who are like hooking up with Drake and shit at this type of fucking party. How fucking awesome is that? Right. And, and then because we're putting this together, we get the clout, we get the alpha male status. And then instantly we get all the fucking attractive female attention on us. And the best part 
is it doesn't, in the end, probably won't cost us anything or won't cost much or we probably end up profiting off of it because all the guys who are pitching in money before the event has even started, week before the event even started, we have guys sending us money saying, hey man, no problem, here's some money. I would love to come to this amazing fucking party, right? So we tell each guy, hey, pitch in 50, 100 bucks, whatever, right? Bring booze. And so every guy who's gonna show up is gonna bring alcohol, provide value in whatever way they can. And the best part is we have a five to one ratio of girls to guys. At least, if not a 10 to 1 ratio of girls to guys, I would say a 5 to 1 ratio of girls to guys is a sweet spot. Because if, if you have too many girls and not enough guys, the girls start getting competitive, uh, too competitive, and they start getting angry and wanting to leave. But if you have five to girl, five girls for every one guy, it ends up being a perfect party. If you have five girls for every one guy, it ends up being a great fucking party. And it ends up being really fun. So now we got sponsors for the event. We've got free drugs, marijuana. We got alcohol taken care of. Because we're even telling the girls bring alcohol. We're telling everyone who shows up, hey, you're welcome to donate alcohol to the bar. You're welcome to donate a bottle to the bar. Right? Now, what do we have to pay for? We have to pay for security. We have to pay for the bartender. We have to pay for... Uh, I mean, like hypothetically, you could pay for a DJ or you can get a DJ free invite or find a DJ friend to DJ for you for free. You can, look, if you want to throw your own party, you can find someone to run security for you, bartend for you, DJ for you, whatever you want, photos, everything. You can find someone to do everything for free pretty much, but it's actually better when you pay people because they'll actually do a good job. They'll actually do a good job when you pay them. When you pay people and pay them well, they'll actually do a fucking fantastic job. And then in order to finance the event, you can literally find sponsors. You can find rich companies. You can... Dude, you can get like a rich big companies to give you money, to give you money, use that money to pay the people who are helping you run the events. It's really cool. So just by using your social skills and you building, you know, connections, awesome. Everything's paid for. You might even make profit off of it, right? So oftentimes, like a lot of these companies even sponsor our event are literally willing to give us money if they can post their, you know, the branding and stuff around because think about this, right? It's free marketing for them. They're, they're a party of like 150, 200 people right and a lot of people coming it's like models influencers youtubers tiktokers uh seven eight nine figure business owners if all these people are coming to my party and you know networking and you know doing all these cool things and they see oh this party is sponsored by we posers it sponsors it's sponsored by daydream it's sponsored by uh, this catering company right well awesome now they're you know these these companies are actually even willing to give you money to do the event because they're getting cloud off it and they're getting business off of it. We're even filming everything, right? We can use it for social media. And guess what? Now their brand is associated with hot girls, cool bougie events, cool parties, cool lifestyle, TikTokers, YouTubers, all this, all this cool fucking stuff, right? Now, I didn't start from doing this stuff. I started with running the streets, hitting the streets, doing day game. Guess where we're meeting most of these girls? We're meeting them on the street via cold approach pickup, motherfucker, day game. So, if you want to learn about how to actually meet girls and how to actually cold approach these girls and actually meet these girls in the first place, it's called Day Game Mastery. I mastered the art form of Day Game and I teach it to a lot of my students, okay? Daygamemastery.org. Go to daygamemastery.org. Do that right fucking now. And you can do two things. You can sign up for a free VIP email list where you're going to get a ton of free value, videos, articles, content and coaching material we're gonna learn how to actually master your day game but what you can also do is you can actually get the day game course the day game mastery course okay and you're gonna learn how to actually master your day game we've got the essentials tier the advanced tier the elite tier and the mastery tier those four tiers so you can learn how to pretty much go from a guy who's socially awkward anxious and weird to literally meeting girls on the street in the mall in the park or even the nightclub the bar Wherever the fuck you go, or maybe a social venue, a social circle party, a party like mine, you learn how to get these girls on your social media, on your Instagram, uh, you get their phone numbers, whatever, and then you can learn how to throw your own parties. You can learn how to create your own events. You can get them on a date. So you can do whatever the fuck you want because once you have these beautiful women in your life, they want to come out with you and they want to hang out with you and they want to be part of your lifestyle. Okay? It's pretty amazing. So go to daygamemastery.org. You can actually learn how to meet these girls. The best part is these skills. These same skills are the skills I use to throw these amazing parties and network with cool dudes and <laughs> bring people together, create an amazing lifestyle, create amazing friendships, and you can even make a fuck ton of money. Because think about this. Right, I'm running a six-figure nightlife business off of this shit. Right, I end up running uh, all these crazy parties, crazy events. You can use this to travel any country in the world, any city in the world, and make friends from scratch. I moved to random countries all the time. I moved to LA. I moved to Mexico twice. I moved to Australia 
three times, I think now. Uh, different cities, Brisbane, Australia, Sydney, Australia. You can move to random fucking places by yourself and go make friends using these skills, day game, day game mastery. So go to day game mastery org and learn these skills, master your day game and change your life forever. And if you guys want to learn more about parties, what you can do is follow me on Instagram. My new Instagram, drunk Justin too. If you're cool, I might even follow you back. And if you message me, if you followed me, I will literally reply to any message. I do. I do actually reply to a lot of messages. So yeah, follow me and message me. And you can actually watch my daily Instagram stories and watch me do this live every single day using Instagram as a platform, as a tool to create this lifestyle and create these parties, create these events. It's amazing. So go to uh, my Instagram, Drunk Justin 2, and go ahead and follow me and be part of my community. You can maybe come to my parties. <laughs> come to my fucking parties. Fuck it. Why not? Right? And uh, if you guys want to learn more about this stuff, go ahead and follow me here on YouTube. Subscribe to my YouTube channel here on YouTube, Justin Mark, and click the bell notification so you're notified of new videos. And guys, my name is Justin Mark, international dating coach, relationship expert, lifestyle development coach, day game mastery coach. We'll see you soon in a new video. If you like this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up and we'll see you soon. Love you guys. And I hope you guys go out and kill it. Talk to you soon. Peace out.